Hi everybody, I hope you're having a great day. In this video, I'm going to be covering Mr. Immortal, who happens to be the member's pick of the month. He made his first appearance in West Coast Avengers Volume 2, issue number 46, that was released in July of 1989. His real name is Craig Hollis, and he's an American male who was born in Sheboygan, Wisconsin, standing 6 feet 2 inches tall, weighing 156 pounds, also having blue eyes and blonde hair. Now, Mr. Immortal is the only known member of a human evolutionary stage past Homo sapiens sapiens and past Homo sapiens superior, known as Homo supreme, meaning that he's even beyond being classified as a mutant, despite sometimes claiming to be. This next stage in human development simply gives him the ability to have retroactive immortality, being able to near immediately resurrect and heal from any death that happens to him. No matter what way he goes, he will come back, period. This even includes being completely incinerated. This power also makes him not age, being permanently stuck in the physical prime of his life. Matter of fact, it's been stated that Mr. Immortal will comfortably live to see the end of the very universe itself. The only drawback to his ability to self-resurrect and heal is that if he does endure an injury that is not fatal, he'll just heal at a normal human rate, meaning that he can be put out of commission for a little while. So other than this very considerable ability to resurrect from the dead, dude is basically just a normal athletic man with a lot of heart. And the only so-called weakness that he has is that he tends to have fits of rage when he resurrects. And this is due to the extreme pain of the death and resurrection process. Now, living forever in this mortal world can have its drawbacks, which Mr. Immortal learned the hard way. Dealing with watching his loved ones pass on was something he had to learn to cope with early in his life. And during these early stages is when he developed a friendship with the cosmic entity known as Death Urge, who regularly appeared to him starting shortly after his birth. The young Craig would call Death Urge the Urge, who everyone just assumed to be an imaginary friend that happened to consistently put Craig in dangerous situations, like playing patty cake in the middle of heavy traffic. Craig lost his mother and father when he was young. Then later as a young man, he would lose his girlfriend and first love when she took her own life. Craig didn't want to go on, but after Death Urge refused to take him and multiple failed attempts to take his own life, he realized that he had the amazing superpower of immortality. This gave him new hope and he wanted to use his abilities for good. Although he would learn in his first superhero adventure to try to stop a bank robbery that being shot and left for dead by the bad guys is not the best way to stop crime. This is when he decided to put out an ad to form a team. And with the founding members Dinosaur, Big Bertha, Dorman, and Flatman, the Great Lakes Avengers would bust out on the scene, being a self-proclaimed branch of the Avengers. This is also when he would fall in love with his teammate Dinosaur. Despite a lot of mockery and their considerable successes being mostly overlooked, the team insisted on staying together. Over the years, they would even take on new members, some of them being the well-known Squirrel Girl, Leather Boy, Monkey Joe, Tippy Toe, Grasshopper, and even Deadpool. This ragtag team that Mr. Immortal founded and led would even get the recognition of being the Great Lakes Initiative, the 50 State Initiative's team for Wisconsin. One thing that Mr. Immortal's team can always count on is that he will readily sacrifice himself for them at any time and that it really doesn't matter because he'll be back in a few minutes. Now, for his powers and abilities and his influence on the Marvel Universe, for my 1 to 10 rating, I'll give Mr. Immortal a rating of 8, which is an unforgettable rating. I hope everyone enjoyed this video. I'll talk to you next time. Be sure to like, subscribe, and join the new sage.